Why, hello. How is everyone doing? Hope you're having a good day. Um, pardon any freaking on that. How y'all doing? It is a day. Um, I didn't know about these until basically, like, <laughs> yesterday, and I was like, oh, shoot. Uh, I might as well check them out. They're pretty short. Um, the Nintendo one is, like, 40 minutes, and the, uh, Sony one is, like, it's, like, uh, 20 minutes, so it's not a lot. Um, but yes, we shall watch some, some more news. I, <laughs> I know a couple things. Hey Pepper, how you doing? Thanks for stopping in. We're gonna be watching some some directs and showcases. I got spoiled a little bit. Like I heard that there was possibly Animal Crossing news, and then Twitter it keeps pushing tweets to me. Um, and it, it, this time it was just someone complaining about how the Animal Crossing news was, you know, jack all. <laughs> Which honestly, I'm not surprised by. But uh, yeah. Thanks, Twitter. I wish I could turn that feature off. I don't care what random people have to say. I just care about who I follow. Um, <laughs> one of those terrible things. Um, it, I was able to avoid it on my uh, VTuber account for quite a while. It's been doing that for forever on my like personal one. But then all of a sudden it's like, teehee, you thought. Um, so now I get all that. Um, and also, I know something about the the Sony one, which will be fun. And your CB, it's okay. We're gonna we're gonna wake up with some exciting, fast paced video game news. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna hit play, and we shall watch the stuff. Avoid the for you tab. It's not even in the for you tab. It's literally in my notifications. Turning that down. Like literally, it's a notification. Um, in my notifications, and it sends it as a notification to my phone. It's the worst. Yeah. Because <laughs> I also avoid the For You tab. Oh, right off the bat. Is this really the quality? That's the quality. Okay. Probably doesn't look terrible on the other end, but it looks kind of wonky here. I don't know. This looks really exciting, though. Oh man. I'm all for more Splatoon. So ready for the order. <laughs> oh geez. Salmon run to the max. I love the little pearl computer. Or, you know, drone. <gasps> Sickle, mate. Not your enemy. Did fish act? Marina's bestie. <gasps> oh, we're collecting colors. Okay. Interesting. Ooh. Okay, so it's Horde mode-esque. A lot of it. Surely there is some other stuff too, though. We're Tron! <laughs> it's got a booty. Yeah, uh, the, the, the squid and inkling... No, they're the same thing. Uh, the, the inklings and octolings all kind of have hips for days. <laughs> I feel like that's always been their thing. Hello. You just saw a new trailer for Wave 2 of the Splatoon 3 expansion pass. I need to get the Splatoon DLC. <laughs> I haven't yet. In the Spire of Order, where you will see characters abilities as you ascend the spire's floors. We are developing this single player DLC so it can be played over and over again. It's planned to release in spring 2024. Okay, I've got some time. Okay, let's see our first Good, because I just bought a couple of other games that I'm wanting to play in the next couple weeks. The, the toys are back in town! Aha! Mario! The rivalry that heated up on the Game Boy Advance system reignites on the Nintendo Switch system. 
It's whatchamacallit, the, the toy stuff. Lemmings, but not. And it's up to Mario to track him down. Hmm, not quite. And other challenges await. Interesting. Observation and action are vital to your success. Mario needs to reach the key, but he can't quite cross the gap. Hmm. Simply jump that it. Monkey's tail looks a little suspicious, though, doesn't it? If Mario does a little sus. I prefer this over the lemming style. Yeah, lemmings is for a very specific type of person, and it's not really me. The video's a little quiet, I'll bump it up even more. Reach it with a handstand jump or a backflip. Like that. There we go. Oh, the little ninjas are so cute. Yeah, I think the style appeals to me a bit more. Still not. I don't know if I'll play it, but at the same time, if there's a demo, I'll definitely try it. Why are they handstanding? Mario vs. Donkey Kong launches on Nintendo Switch February 16th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. All right. Save the prince and the world. Save the cheerleader to deflect bricks. I see, I see. Because everyone knows his feet are what he uses to break the bricks, not his head. Right? Tapping into the roots of the Prince of Persia series, this game features 2D side scrolling action adventure gameplay. No oh boy. Breathtaking environments in a mythological Persian inspired world. But don't linger too long if you hope to survive. Harness sword and bow techniques as well as time powers to best these hostile lands. As your journey progresses, Sargon will grow stronger and learn new abilities that expand his arsenal. Equip amulets to further boost your abilities, among other perks. The this is very Hollow Knight-esque. So choose wisely. Use everything at your disposal to navigate this harsh world and defeat- And I mean that in a it looks good kind of way. way. Get ready to save the prince and <laughs> they say going back to the series roots, the only thing that this has in common is that it's a side scroller. Interesting. Yeah. It, it's definitely uh in-game warrior within style-wise a lot more modern, for sure. I don't know, maybe people will enjoy it. I have no idea. <gasps> Chase for true arcade racing in Horizon Chase 2. Speed through stunning environments, each with its own dynamic art style, while overtaking your rivals on the road. Play the main campaign to unlock vehicles, speed, and more. You can also upgrade your vehicle and style it to fit your high octane needs. Itching for more racing action? Meh. Four speedsters can put the pedal to the metal in count. Listen, I've sold my soul to Mario Kart. You can't change it. In Horizon Chase 2, launching on Nintendo Switch later today. Oh, later today. Wow. Musical mayhem in this rhythm based adventure. Time your button presses with the music to solve puzzles and battle bosses. This could be on my alley. Thrilling tracks away, including music from iconic Konami games. Ooh. Up to four friends can battle it out in versus modes or jam together in local or online play. Super Crazy Rhythm Castle launches on Nintendo Switch November 14th. Pre-orders begin okay. today on Nintendo eShop. I'm interested, I'm interested. <laughs> Spy Family. Has a new assignment from school. Creating of course a it's diary. <laughs> on weekdays, you'll head to class, then enjoy family time in the evenings. On days off, you can visit all sorts of exciting places, like the beach the <laughs> or an art museum, in search of subjects to photograph. How will you spend your time with friends and family? Tiny Girl Simulator, exactly. Will you help Anya make? Oh, speaking Spot of, Anya uh, Volks announced a, uh, Anya, next year. uh, vinyl doll. A little spency, but that's Volks. Um, but it's like a new return. scale for them. It looks cute. The Super Mario RPG game is back with updated graphics. 
Let's go over some new Let's and returning gameplay features. Time your button presses with action commands to increase damage dealt or decrease damage received. But it's got like the oh face instead of like a smile, so it's kind of polarizing. Let's see here. Every successful action command will fill this gauge. When it's full, I'll show it afterwards. Character <laughs> triple move. Mario RPG hype, yeah. I know a lot of people are into it. I never played it, so I don't have the nostalgia for it. But I know it's very well loved. During your adventure, you'll encounter bosses with colorful personalities. After clearing the game, you can fight some of them again. One more time. But these powered up bosses aren't gonna be easy. Ooh. Uh. This is good music. Set off for adventure with Mario and friends when Super Mario RPG <laughs> launches on the Nintendo Switch system November 17th. Pre not sure. Are available now I've, on I've heard this and I'm not sure if it was th from uh, Smash Bros. or just like general uh, hearing it somewhere. Either way, great song. The Nintendo DS game Trace Memory returns on the Nintendo Switch system. Another, another COD. Code, two memories. One day, a young girl named Ashley receives a letter from the father she thought had passed away. Seeking answers, she sets off for the solitary Blood Edward Island in search of him. Once there, Ashley encounters puzzles and obstacles. Pretty popular that song. There were a few lyrical versions. I see, I see. Understandable why it's popular. <laughs> How does it open? Parts. Just make Lost. <laughs> or Lost JPEG. Can you Ghost. see me? This is cool. She also yeah. meets a mysterious boy. What truths await Ashley in this place? And no matter how hard I try, I can't remember Dad's Aww. face. Who are you? The sequel, Another Code R, Journey into Lost Memories, previously unreleased in North America, is also <laughs> included. So this is like Juliet, huh? Play both games to experience the full story. Unravel both adventures. Interesting, interesting. For Nintendo Switch, when Another Code Whoa. Recollection launches January 19th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Another code January. recollection includes two games, the Nintendo DS game Trace Memory and its Wii sequel which was never released in North America. Both games are fully enhanced on Nintendo Switch. Please look forward to playing them early next year. Next, please take a look at this. Each time. One day. A loyal toad presented a flyer advertising a show at the Sparkle Theater. Princess Peach and some toads went to go see it, but then... The Wicked Grape and the Sour Bunch suddenly made their grand grape? entrance and took center stage. Okay. Now, it's up to grape Peach ruined the, the theater. theater's guardian Stella to save the play and the day. This perfect cute, performance cute. has become a terrible tragedy. Luckily, Peach can use Peach the power grape. Of yeah, okay, you're right. It makes sense. Against the sour bunch. Yep. The ribbon alone won't always cut it, though. So power of a ponytail. <laughs> An outfit change too. Whoa! Mm -hmm. Peach transformed into Sword Fighter Peach. Let's so go. Transforming, she can use fantastic show-stopping abilities. Princess to Ribbon. <laughs> with sensational sword play. Can Peach save this performance and its performers? I do love this. There are more stolen shows to save. <laughs> Valuable artifacts from this museum have gone missing. Become <gasps> detective Peach. Adorable. Oh my gosh. And track down who done it. 
<laughs> Amelia Peachson, yes. Desserts have been snatched from this sweet festival. Turn into patissier peach and save it from a sugar. This is all adorable. The sour bunch got their hands on this martial arts school. Become Let's go. Peach and take it back from these foul fiends. She's so cute in everything. Nice. Many other transformations. This is beautiful. I love it. Curtain. The stage is set. Our leading lady is ready this for is... the spotlight. I was already pretty much convinced to get it, but you know, Princess even more Peach, so now. Showtime makes its debut on Nintendo March. Okay. Twenty-second. Can't believe it took this long for Peach to get another Nintendo game. Nintendo. I know, right? They're too busy making a uh, new Super Mario Bros. 15. You know, it probably was way more lucrative than, like, a Peach game, but at the same time, like, Peach is beloved. I would love it if there's a Rosalina game in the future, too. Something about her, like, exploring the stars, I don't know. Saga series. I am actually interested in playing these. full of rich stories awaits in Saga Emerald Beyond. Someday. There are six heroes. There's so many games. From. A young man who fights with sentient puppets. Hey yo. A witch disguised as a schoolgirl to mask her identity. <laughs> a crime fighting duo chasing down a mysterious organization. A songstress mech who lost her voice and body. Interesting. And a king of darkness who was recently reawakened. Select a hero, then follow their journey through 17 interconnected worlds as they strive to achieve their goals. How the story unfolds is in your hands. The choices you make can unlock different paths more than ever before seen in the Saga franchise. Fight in timeline battles, turn-based combat in which turn order is crucial to victory. Use special techniques to control the order of actions. Or hmm. activate team combos to swing the tide <laughs> of battle in your favor. Saga Emerald Beyond launches on Nintendo Switch next year. The legendary Raider oh returns. Boy. The first three Tomb Raider games, all with upgraded visuals, are venturing onto Nintendo Switch in I'm sure someone out there is going to be like, oh man, it looks so ugly, but like, there's only so much you can do. <laughs> it looks fine. The classics, yes. Climb, backflip, backflip. through perilous quests, different countries and mythologies. Along the way. You'll solve puzzles to uncover treasures of the ancient world and unravel mysteries lost to the ravages it just, of time. It is interesting this just how different some of these textures are. The expansions and secret levels for each game. You can also toggle between the original polygon look and the upgraded visuals at any time. <laughs> Tomb Raider 1 through 3 Remastered, starring Lara Croft, launches on the Nintendo Switch system February 14th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Yo, boy. This detective's got a second bolt of brilliance. Oh, the updated graphics don't look all that great, but it's probably necessary Every for the toggle. Yeah. Starts their day I mean... This is Rhyme City, a place where for what it was, there's only so much you can do to, like, change it. Aside from a full-on, like, re remake <laughs> so i think they did a good job with what they had as the bones you know tim interviews people pikachu interviews pokemon and they find the truth together good they'll also rely on other pokemon to broaden the scope of their investigations follow sense with growlith smash rocks with darman i don't know i have and feelings walls with Luxray. about how this looks because it feels really flat all the mysteries and find but at the same time like i am like the first to say the graphics don't matter that much as long as it's consistent so like i don't know i i can't i shouldn't be too insane about it <laughs> but like i don't know it just doesn't look shiny and appeal <sighs> pokemon has a oh, heck yeah trombone chain <laughs> Uh, but yeah, uh, I don't know, Pokemon games, 
I wish they'd put a bit more effort into the graphics. As much as I don't have strong feelings about it, I'd like a really nice looking one. Yeah. <laughs> Gyro controls to adjust the pitch. I think for this, the PC really is like the best way to play it. Oh, Theremin. The controls are pretty unique and mastering every Theremin style. Walk in the park. Honk your way through nearly 50 songs spanning various. This game is hilarious. Luigi Denza. Oh, there's a multiplayer mode. Together in local multiplayer. That's pretty funny. Trombone champ slides onto Nintendo Switch <laughs> later today. <laughs> I think I've seen enough of Trombone Champ, but it is hilarious. See, the PC is good because you've got all the goofy, like, uh, mods that you can do and someone made a, a one-winged angel one. It's beautiful. Trombone champ one-winged angel is truly a thing of wonder. Interesting. Interesting. Dundee. And launches first for consoles Dundee. on Nintendo Switch next spring. A close beat Best boy. will be available this October. Please play your mercenaries to fame and fortune in this open world tactical RPG. Take up various contracts from protecting townsfolk from thieves to vanquishing the land's most notorious figures. Before Not my that, kind of game, but I can see it being with the best gear and skills interesting. To victory and live to see another day. Bonk, the bonk. four players online can jointly <laughs> command a troop and journey together across this vast world. War Tales launches as a timed console exclusive on Nintendo Switch later today. Oh. Run and gun in this reimagining of the beloved oh. NES classic Contra. Blast through explosive stages Operation with a Galuga. devastating arsenal of weapons to crush the Red Falcon forces. Spring into action with easy pick up and play controls and a variety of difficulty options. This reimagining from Konami and Way Forward features new weapons. Up, down, up, down. Enemies, left, right, left, right. Super PA star. That's all you need to know. Co -op mode. Contra, so left, right, left, right, left, right, up, down, up, down. Mm -hmm. the oh, it's left, right, left, right. Early next year. <laughs> I'm surprised Way Forward worked on this because it looks. It's a little, uh. Interesting. I wonder how it plays, because I feel like that's the main thing when you're doing a Contra game. It's gotta feel good, right? Destiny, stolen minds, and stolen nations. Yet as the world stands consumed by immense evil, a fallen prince shall rise again. The art on this does look really cool. What sorcery is this? Oh, and then it's <laughs> Ring of the Unicorn! Legend speaks of your ancestors wielding it to purify evil. They stole my ring. Stay now. The path before us is laid bare, and all that remains now is to walk it. Do I need to play it just for that? <laughs> Corn. Freely traverse an expansive world. Interesting. Allies, forge your bonds, and lead the liberation to glorious victory. It's got like. Fire Emblem and Octopath vibes for me. Sixty unique characters, from humans hey, yo. to massive beasts and heavenly angels. <gasps> Today marks our first foray. What about a unicorn? Despair, which hang heavy over our home. It may take days, oh, months, food, or even years, but I shall see the duties of my blood. I don't have years. Atlas. Okay, it's Atlas. Nowhere, present the rebirth of tactical fantasy RPGs. Unicorn Overlord. Yo. Available March 8th, 2024. Somebody gives you mobile game vibes. I can see that, yeah. It's got like a weird gameplay hasn't sold me. <laughs> the art style fantastic. Peak 10 out of 10. Weegee. Oh,
Luigi's Yo. Mansion 2 ah. HD. Port of Two. Welcome to Evershade Valley, a place that's screaming and teeming with the supernatural. Glad we're getting Luigi 2. It's a good game. I'm glad. I'm glad. Yeah. Check it out. So I know they did one a while ago, and then three came out on like the uh, 3DS. No yeah. Maybe they didn't do one. I don't know. -like I think I'm just Alter confusing guys. everything. And then there was the Switch. To light up dark yeah. Vacuum up objects. Three was Switch. Okay. I don't remember things. It's a handy tool for your paranormal escapades. Oh, yeah. Plus, when oh, yeah. You spot there a are only three. One was remade on the 3DS. Okay, that's what it was. Yeah, they should port it to Switch, too. <laughs> the Switch as well, I mean. Although, you know, if there is a Switch, too, hey. They're not gonna move away from the Switch this soon. It's... got so much... like an install base. <laughs> Ooh. These troublemakers will use every trick in the book to Aww. block your path. Ghost dog. Can Luigi summon if the rumors about it being backwards compatible is true, I'll be so happy. Yeah, yeah. Looking for other ghost ghost needs up to four players online can to have higher. Oh gosh, it's a little. You can see it's got a little crust on it. <laughs> it does its best though. Creeps onto Nintendo Switch next summer. Interesting. How was that? Next, we have two announcements to share. <gasps> two? First, please take a look at this video. But yeah, Switch 2, whatever the next one is, I just wanted to have, like, way better hardware power. Blocks. Boop -a -doo. Question block. What's that? But a, a big... Question block. Actually, this question block Geo -guesser. appears on the roof of the previously announced Nintendo Gallery that's under construction in Uji City, e. Kyoto Prefecture. Oh. The official name of this gallery will be the Nintendo Museum. Interesting. At the Nintendo Museum, a wide variety of Nintendo products from the company's history will be displayed. Construction is going well, and we plan to finish up by March 2024. We'll share more information, such as the opening date. Not aware this was a thing. I'm not gonna lie, I didn't know it was a thing either. They say previously announced, but this is the first time I'm hearing of it. <laughs> Maybe they just hadn't announced it in a direct, it was just somewhere else. Zelda and Ganon. And amiibo figures of Noah and Mio oh, from the Xenoblade they look cool. Game I will be still really haven't played a Xenoblade January game. <laughs> I like and those finally, designs quite a bit, though. They're cute. Figure to announce. <laughs> the DLC fighter Sora. Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, Sora Let's go. Kingdom Hearts is on the way. With the release of Sora, everyone is here from Super Smash Bros. Everyone is here. Form. Please look forward to its release next year. That's all for Gotta cop that. Yeah. Next, please take a look at this. Ah, uh, this! This is another thing I got a little spoiled to. At least... Kind of. The first F-Zero game. <laughs> Whoa! That's, a 99 player That's battle yeah. Royale. It's their next Tetris. <laughs> <laughs> this one I'd be way more into, though. I like my racing. I would die. But, you know. Nothing wrong with that. be careful. Your power meter will decrease if you crash into pilots or guardrails. If it's yep. zero, you're out. Rip. You'll need to avoid collisions and conserve your power meter to stay in the race. Interesting. Risky? Spend some of your power meter for a temporary speed boost. Use boost power. You can also collect super sparks, which appear when machines collide, to boost oh. up to a special path called the Skyway. Ooh. Bypassing your rivals and jumping Interesting. Into a position. It's cheat time, let's go. You're racing to unlock cosmetic options for your machine. Heck yeah. 
I love me cosmetics. <laughs> I'll give this one a shot. 99 players, one winner. It's time hey. to race your way to first place. Because F099 oh, this isn't limited time like Mario, yeah. Active Nintendo Switch online members later today. Okay. More than 30 years. Which means it's probably yeah, you know, let me let me just grab my Switch here. Battle Royale game. This title also supports the Super NES controller available exclusively for Nintendo Switch Online Oh boy, the SNES controller. We hope you will give it a try and aim for first place. Okay. Didn't say anything about limited time, so I'm hoping it's just kind of eternal. One little hero, one humongous problem. Cute art style. Welcome to Vandal oh. City, a whimsical just so land inhabited by small fuzzy beings called Yordles. After a party gets a little too wild, Yordles the holding the land together collapse and Yordles and Yordles. Chaos. It's up to you and your knitting magic to stitch Vandal City back together. Journey across the land to gather materials. Right, I'm downloading the F Zero now. The by the way, <laughs> as you continue gathering and crafting, you can weave together new upgrades by unlocking more branches of the skill tree. Bingle purples and scribbly apples. Yes. By embarking on quests and hosting festivals for the community, can you save Vandal City? And what mysteries will you discover during your magical adventure? Scrungle the bean and guess until it sprinkles. I don't know. <laughs> launches on Nintendo Switch. Oh, it's year. League of Legends. Oh, it's those little guys. Okay. Wait. I didn't connect the dots. <laughs> Join best friends Nunu and Willem on a journey across the frozen wilds of the Freljord. Jump. Freljord. And sled your way through a beautiful yet treacherous land, where every step taken and each puzzle solved will bring you okay. closer to the truth. Better not look too closely at the rest of that, past. otherwise I am going to uh, Nunu, Legends another League of Legends. Another League of Legend. On the Nintendo Switch Song of Nunu. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo. Oh. All right, Let's we got our League of Legends, Legends, I guess. Play with these chumps doesn't feel like a prize. Ah. Hey, right here. Greetings. Welcome to the island. When people say scrunkly, I don't think friendly cuddly thing makes me think of <laughs> scummy creatures. Maybe Vinny's corrupted my mind. Yeah, uh, it doesn't sound very like cute and cuddly to me. Ah, the forms are back. Copy the form shown, then perform the correct action as quick as you can. Hand model. Hand mode. The micro games will come one after another. Fashionista. So Smooth moves too, baby. Yes. Plus, up to four players can battle it out. Medusa march. Ooh. Yeah. The goal without getting caught by Medusa. No. It's red light, green light. To be the last one posing. With over 200 Fun. lightning fast micro games and multiplayer modes of plenty. Everyone's in for a wacky Oh my. WarioWare Move It launches on the Nintendo Switch system November 3rd. All right, all right. Available I'm down. On Nintendo I'm down. <laughs> a heroic tale will soon unfold. Lead an army of over 100 heroes into battle and put an end to an oh. empire's invasion. Hey, you then. Meet okay. Noah, a humble villager. Sane, an officer from the Empire. And Marissa, a forest guardian. These three band together to fight for a common goal. We're getting a lot of On their journey, this kind of... Heroes who can join their oh my gosh, the sharks. <laughs> this is your home base, known I have got some run out of his stream video since you're freezing a bit. Oh no. Additional facilities will become um. available. You'll be able to tend crops, oh, the bit rate's being a bit jank. Each hero I can't you encounter has their fix own that while streaming. Hmm. They may not always get along at first, but these conflicts may strengthen the bonds hmm. between your heroes. I did Trust. change the bit rate, so maybe I just Justice aborked it. <laughs> a heroic tale will begin After this, 
Hmm. I don't know. Maybe I'll check it after this. Too many things running at once, maybe. Next stop, Octopia. Travel to a charming parallel world in this paid DLC for Eastward. What's that for a bit, maybe? I don't know. Turn the pages of a new chapter as they adjust to country life in a mountainside village. Tend to livestock. Horrible. Whip up culinary delights for your neighbors. And restore buildings to help the village thrive. And if you're new to Eastward, I need to just stop worry, like stop messing DLC with my settings, honestly. Played the main story. Eastward, just feel like all my Tokyo stuff's been really like on to Nintendo Switch blurry. This <laughs> so I was trying to make it look nicer, but then back into the group. I bungle everything. Oh! <laughs> Charge across three tactical campaigns oh. with valiant factions, including a new mouse <laughs> faction, the Fari. You. Plus, you can now supercharge your commander's groove to unleash devastating attacks. Lead You've got groove power. In conquest mode. Battle Please friends be locally or online. Or is that create too? and share your own cutscenes and campaigns. And, uh... War Groove 2 marches on to Nintendo Switch as a console exclusive October 5th. Get out of my way! Pre-orders <laughs> begin today on Nintendo <laughs> eShop. That was visceral. Dying <laughs> blue catch fish hole? by day. Then oh, serve this. them as sushi by night and the aquatic adventure, Dave the Diver. Oh. Use the fish you've caught to concoct recipes and create the day's menu. Then tend to the clamoring customers at your sushi restaurant. Explore an ever-changing underwater world to find the best ingredients and strive <gasps> to exceed culinary expectations. Dave the Diver launches first for consoles on the Nintendo Switch system October 26th. Pre-orders and a free demo swim onto Nintendo eShop later no! today. It's my cousin. <laughs> final wave is Let's go. In. Here's a sneak peek at wave six. Uh, the final wave easy, of the Mario whatever. Kart Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC from the Mario Kart Wii Daisy Circuit. More yes. returning characters are also being added in wave six. <laughs> like from Daisy. The Mario Kart Double Dash game. Diddy Kong nice. From Mario Kart Wii. Oh. Funky Kong. Rosalina again. From the Mario Kart yeah, I figured. Pauline. Not surprised. And also, Peach. Aww. Cute. Wave six of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Good, Booster good, good, Course good. DLC for the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe game drives when? on to Nintendo Switch this okay. holiday. Okay. Okay. In a couple Nintendo months. Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack members can enjoy this DLC at no additional cost. The DLC can also be purchased on its own. Something Amogus. is among us. <laughs> that was me. <laughs> oh boy. Sus. Is it a new stage, perhaps? Oh no! The spores, the shrooms! <laughs> They're dead. Just kidding. <laughs> well, that one is. It's fine. Yeah, new stage. Yo, boy. <laughs> the fungal. This new the fungal funny. This <laughs> I'm not special. <laughs> I am not unique. 
Thanks for sticking I'm not immune to Vinny propaganda. Next up, we'd like to recap some of the previously announced Nintendo titles you can look forward to playing from September onwards. Let's take a look. Ah, uh, yeah, the Pokemons. One and two physical. Oh, that was a troll bit. It's, I think it is, but Vinny also does it, and I watch more Vinny. <laughs> I think it. I think it might be a troll bit, though. You're right. Well, either way, I'm not immune to uh, propaganda of the video gamer variety. <laughs> Peach. Peach. Yeah, I haven't tried any of it yet, we but uh, I went grocery shopping time. yesterday and I got some kiwi this next video will be our last uh, uh, ice cream. Don't know what would be worse, fungal or fecal funny. Uh, I think fecal just for the fact of what it is, but fungal ain't much better. Depending on what kind of fungal we're talking about, if we're talking like a fungal infection, then uh, 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 no. But if we're just talking like a mushroom, uh, that's pretty normal. Also, the Mario's. This thing! Yes. It looks good. It looks like they did a good job remaking it. Cute, cute. Ooh. Thin. Woo. Oh yeah, Gonzalez. <laughs> nice. Bloopy. You. Let's go. Never beat the final boss of the original. Can't wait to beat it this time. I believe you got this. This looks fun. Another good game <laughs> that I've never played, but I know people love. I watch Game Grumps play it, and that's about my experience with it. But it looks good. The mystery? Hot dog. Oh. I just love the style of it. Cute. <laughs> what has happened to me? Pause for the while you're in love with me. Princess Peach, will you teach me to feel this thing you call love? In 2024, can love bloom on the, the, the total field? Mario, the thousand -year door the Bowser field. <laughs> will return also, it looks like the bitrate has stabilized a bit. I guess I just needed to uh, it, close some to stuff. This <laughs> <in Paper laughs> World starring Mario and friends. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Hopefully it won't Thank you tank watching. again once we do Fortnite. But hey, good stuff, good stuff. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so uh, the internet lied to me about Animal Crossing, and I'm fine with that. Like, I really don't expect much Animal Crossing news in general at this point. <laughs> but yeah. Good stuff. I'm excited for a lot of that. Still freezing to the stream, it's not buffering, the picture just freezes. Oh no! I'm gonna explode. Let's see here. Uh, yeah, I can't touch this while I'm streaming. Uh, uh, well, shall we deal with it today or shall we uh, end stream for a moment and fix it? I'm fine either way. <laughs> mm. Mm. 
I think I might instrument for like two seconds, fix it, and then come back. I think that might be the better call. <laughs> All right. Um. So yes, let's let's do that real quick. I will just bump the bit rate down a pinch. I think that'll fix it. Cause it's just a punk. Such a punk. All right. I will see you in just.